go back to an earlier story I told you about the former vice president, that is Kalonzo Musioka, who has offered himself up for investigations over allegations of land grabbing. Kalonzo has said the land in question is legally his, and he is ready to answer questions regarding the said parcel of land. Kalonzo was replying to allegations that were made by Deputy President William Brito in Bomet that he grabbed government land in Yata Machakas County. Daniel Karaoke with the full details. In what seems to be a battle of wits between the two possible contenders in the 2022 presidential elections, between the former VP Kalonzo Musioka and DP William Ruto, has exploded following land grabbing allegations made by DP on Friday last week. Musioka fighting off claims of illegally acquiring yet land alleged to be belonging to the National Youth Service. I'm today presenting myself for a thorough investigation by the Directorate of Criminal Investigation as well as the Ethics and Anti-Corruption Commission. I challenge D.P. Ruto Alas Arab Mashamba, well known for his unbridled greed for both public and private land, to offer himself for investigation. Last week, the deputy president claimed that the former vice president had been in power for more than 40 years, but had not done anything tangible for the country, and making assertions that he was not fit to hold office, alleging that his current home is built on government land. How are watu wanatuuzia uoga? Wanatuambia musipafanya hii, tutawapeleka kotini. Musipafanya hii, tutawafanya hii. Tutafunga account zenu. Addressing a rally in Bomet on Friday, D.P. Ruto made a frivolous and unsubstantiated claim to the effect that I grabbed government land in Yatta. The former vice president turning the tables on the deputy president, claiming he has also grabbed parcels of land, further challenging the D.P. to offer himself for investigations and a lifestyle audit. I urge Arab Mashamba to stop being hypocritical and to take responsibility for his misdeeds which stink to the high heavens. The grabbing of the piece of land on which Western Hotel stands. It is in public knowledge that the land is public property belonging to Kenya Airports Authority. The WIPA leader also called for answers from the DP following the recent deaths of his two staff members, Sergeant Kenei in the Gold Arm scandal and Officer David Toh in the Suicide Camera scandal. DP Ruto should be ready to also give a statement on what he knows about the recent camera scandal that led to one of his bodyguards uh, to commit suicide. Is there more than meets the eye in that very sad incident? Daniel Karyuki for Switch TV, Nairobi.